Hi. In this episode of Church 101, we're giving our review of the National Institute for Christian Leadership with Dr. Mark Rutland, and we're also excited to announce the free raffle that Rednecks for Jesus is offering for you to attend the NICL in 2023. This is a $1,000 value. It seemed odd that the Holy Spirit prompted me to attend the National Institute for Christian Leadership Training. Rednecks for Jesus is a small, unsanctioned ministry with a small budget, having little in common organizationally with 501c3s that most of Dr. Rutland's teaching seems tailored for. At $1,000, the cost of admission was steep compared with Rednecks for Jesus' $10,000 annual budget. For me, the experience became like Jeremiah going down to the potter's house. There is a Redeemer, Jesus, God's own Son, precious Lamb of God, Messiah, Holy One. For the Lord to talk to me there, my wife, attending with me, also had a deep sense of hearing from the Lord regarding her professional work, her ministry work, and her encouragement of Rednecks for Jesus. Up to four people from an organization may attend all four three-day sessions for the $1,000 fee. At times, the training was like seeing how sausage is made, but mostly it was engaging, exciting, informative, and transformative. Dr. Mark, a man who has been there and done that, shared his heart about many important topics for Christian ministry. We learned that quality is meeting expectations. I give Dr. Mark an A plus with the note that my expectations were greatly exceeded. We attended the sessions in order at Buford Church of God in Georgia. In the January session on change dynamics, we learned about types of leaders and leadership styles. We learned about the difference between management and leadership and about tensions in ministry leadership. We learned to analyze what's really happening in our ministries if our goal is turning the ship for lasting and impactful change. While we depend on Scripture and on the Holy Spirit to frame our goals, Dr. Mark provided a wealth of practical insights on how to reach those goals in our specific ministry settings. Our ministry culture has a bigger impact on the quality of our outcomes than our team's skills. We also learned how to effectively recognize and address subversive mindsets. We learned that we need to state expectations in a clearly measurable way. These expectations form a social contract both with those we serve and with those who serve with us. Unstated expectations sink ships, they sink marriages, and they sink ministries. Excellence is the process of restating expectations upward as the Lord provides prompting and willing hands. We learn to manage stress with positive coping mechanisms, how to recognize toxicity, and when to move on to another opportunity. The setting was informal and Dr. Mark answered all of our questions with patient endurance. I didn't count, but it seemed to be about 40 attendees in each session. Attendees were friendly and conversational, and many breaks were filled with brainstorming and encouraging one another. Each session was closed in prayer for a specific anointing or a specific blessing to the end of fulfilling the Great Commission in our ministries. Many of those prayers are already being answered for me. Each session is described in some detail at the NICL.com website, so I won't repeat those details all here. 
We especially like the October session on worship and preaching. The worship section focused on how to excel at identifying and communicating biblical goals for worship and services and how to prayerfully choose songs to meet those goals. Managing the challenging egos of musicians and worship leaders was a point of emphasis with lots of practical details. We appreciated the identification of different purposes of worship music and how to accomplish them as the Holy Spirit leads. Being called to preach personally, the sections on preaching were my favorite parts of the whole NICL. Dr. Mark held nothing back and answered every question about he, how he preaches and plans his sermons. Many questions were challenging and I appreciated the honest modesty in Dr. Mark's replies, acknowledging God's power made perfect in his weaknesses. Preaching is a unique combination of anointing by the Holy Spirit and the sweat of our brow. We could feel the anointing pouring out on us as Dr. Mark prayed for our preaching in the close of the session. I could hear the Holy Spirit screaming in my heart, preach, preach, preach. It was the empowering fiat of him who holds all authority in heaven and on earth. Preach, preach, preach. <laughs> to put our money where our mouth is, I'm not only recommending the NICL training as you may be prompted by the Holy Spirit, but Rednecks for Jesus is having a free raffle for us to pay the full $1,000 tuition plus some processing fee to the winning, for the winning ministry or organization, even if your organization is no bigger than your household. Up to four people from your organization may attend at the $1,000 tuition level that RFJ, Rednecks for Jesus, will pay to the NICL on your behalf. To enter the raffle, be one of the first 20 people to leave a comment below on the original YouTube, Facebook, or BitChute video, or contact me privately before November 18th, 2022. I'll put my email in the video descriptions. If this video is shared, be sure to comment below in the original video post or to contact me privately to enter the raffle. Be sure to include your contact information and clearly state NICL raffle. The tuition money goes to Global Servants and is supporting their girls' homes in Ghana and Thailand so Rednecks for Jesus is managing to bless both the winner of the raffle as well as this tremendous ministry. If I get 20 entries below November 18th, I'll announce in the comments that the raffle is closed, so the raffle is only open for the first 20 entries. If I get 20 before November 18th, I'll announce that the raffle is closed I'll put the names in a hat, probably this hat, and draw a winner. I'll probably have my wife draw the winner and we'll then make the arrangements. I used to sing a song asking for more love, more power, and more of Jesus in my life. This is what I found from Dr. Mark at the National Institute of Christian Leadership. In addition to exceeding all the expectations from their website. Listen to Dr. Courtney. Go and get a blessing from Jesus through Dr. Mark. They've announced that 2023 will be their last year for public sessions held in Georgia due to their demand for private training sessions. Go and get your blessing. The NICL.com Rednecks for Jesus is not affiliated with the National Institute for Christian Leadership beyond being a satisfied customer. 
good life is the land where the big grapes grow, milk and honey flow. From the morning till the night, and everybody's singing to Jesus. Yeah, the good life is the land where the big grapes grow, milk and honey flow. From the morning till the night, and everybody's singing to Jesus. Oh, I love Jesus. La 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 la. Jesus. 